Hello, good morning. Uh, this is your lecturer, um, Martin Angel Chikolo, and I'm taking you in project uh, management, which is a PM. So first things first, we define what a project is. What is a project? A project is just a, a, a project is a series of uh, tasks that are one can undertake in order to meet uh, the desired outcome. A project is a series of tasks that one can actually undertake in order to meet the desired uh, outcome. Okay, so always understand that in a project you always have uh, outcomes. Okay, so those tasks that you undertake or that a firm might actually embark on, okay, at the end of the day we must have the desired uh, outcome. Okay, then uh, in defining project management, you can say. Project management is the way the person organizes and uh, manages resources that are necessary to complete a project, okay? Project management is the way a person organizes uh, resources, uh -huh. resources, okay? And then in a way that, of course, uh, in a way that, uh, of course, that will help us achieve uh, the goals and the set objectives of the organization, okay? So in managing uh, 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 projects, uh, people uh, who manage projects, okay, in different ways, and people that manage projects are actually known as uh, project um, managers, okay? People that uh, manage projects are known as project what? They are known as project managers. So a project is a piece of work which is uh, not a process of course or an operation, but it has a start and it has an end also. So you must understand that a project always has a start and the project always comes to an end. So in a project there's a start, then in a project there's also an end. Okay. So always know that the project will always start and the project will always come to to, to uh, an, an end. Okay. What exactly is project management? Uh, project management is the uh, uh, practice of uh, initiation, uh, planning, execution, uh, controlling and closing the work of, of, of a team to achieve the specific goals. Okay. Goals and meet the specific success criteria at the specified uh, time. So you understand that in every project, of course, Every project uh, has got different uh, stages. Every project has got different stages, okay? We have the initiation stage, which is the starting stage. Apart from the initiation, uh, initiation stage, we have the planning stage, okay? After planning, we have uh, the execution stage, okay? After execution stage, of course, uh, we have what we call the closure, okay? We have the closure. Okay? So every project has got different stages. The first stage is our uh, initiation. The second stage is the planning. The third stage is execution. Then the fourth stage is the closing. Okay. At this point now we are closing the project. We are done with the project. So the first stage in the session simply means that this is when a project is actually starting. Okay. The project is after starting, it's at the beginning, it's, at, it's in fact, it's just starting. Then after uh, um, uh, um, the, uh, this stage, we come to the planning, okay? At this stage, of course, it's where uh, members of staff and stakeholders, okay, that uh, might be part of that project come together and just plan, put up uh, 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 one or two things together just to ensure that the project becomes a success. After planning, of course, we have to execute. Whatever we have planned, we now uh, put, uh, we execute or we do or we uh, put it to action. After execution, of course, we close the project and um, forget, about the, forget about the project and move on maybe to the next uh, project. So those are some of the things that uh, you have to understand and know that every project has got different stages. So a project has got how many stages? Four. Uh, the initiation stage, the planning stage, execution stage, and also the uh, closing stage. So one, two, three, four stages of a project. Okay. So what is project management and why is it so important? So we've already defined what uh, project management is. But let, let's look at uh, the importance of a uh, project um, uh, management. Why is it so? Uh, why is it so important? Good project uh, management ensures that the goals, okay, of the projects are closely aligned with the strategic goals of the business. So, a good project management uh, simply means that um, whatever uh, 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 task that we are carrying in a project, they should be able to. They should. They should align, okay, with the goals. They should align with the goals and the set objectives of the firm or the organization, okay? So it's very, very important that every good project management ensures that the goals of the projects are closely aligned with the strategic goals of the business. Because why you understand that um, a business will have different goals, okay? A different goals will be set by a business, but uh, um, uh, those uh, goals should be aligned, of course, with the role that we are doing uh, 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 in that particular uh, project. Okay, so let's look at an example of a project management. 
example of project management. Project management is the science of course and the act of organizing uh, all the components of a project. For example, the launching of a new service. That could be a project, maybe building a school, that could be a project, maybe constructing a road, that could be a project, maybe just uh, um, uh, uh, maybe working on some renovations, that could be a project. Remember what we said, what, what we said earlier on is that um, every project has a start and every project also has uh, what we call an, 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 an end. Okay, so let's look at uh, maybe one or two roles of a project manager. You as a project manager, why? Because when you're studying at this course, of course, we understand that one day maybe you'd like to become a project manager, one day you'd like to manage projects, one day you would like to be the forefront of projects. So let's look at um, uh, the role of a project manager. Or maybe we can say, let's look at the, your role. Okay, because now we look at you as a you are a project manager already, so let's look at the role that you undertake when you become, uh, when, when you're in that uh, office now as a project manager. Okay, so uh, the role of a project manager is that um, is a person that oversees, okay. What does he see? He sees all the responsibility, okay, of the project from the initiation stage, okay. So a project manager oversees all the responsibility. Everything, every task, everything about that project, a project manager ensures that he sees everything. He has to see why? Because it's the one that is the forefront of the um, of the project. Okay. Apart from seeing, of course, he sees uh, the initiation. Of course, the all the stages of the pro of the project. He sees the initiation. He sees the planning stage. He sees the execution stage. He sees also that ensures that the project comes to an end uh, efficiently and effectively. So. Is an, it takes uh, it takes a uh, uh, responsibility of all the activities and all the tasks and all the um, uh, 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 duties or responsibilities that are, are being uh, carried out in that particular uh, project. So it's something that is very very important. Of course, there are many. Um, uh, responsibilities of a project manager just apart from overseeing he also controls he controls uh, the workers he controls the people on the site he controls those that are part of the project apart from controlling he also gives advice okay it's one of his responsibilities uh, he advises the people on how to work efficiently and effectively and he also guides them at the same time he guides them so that the project can actually meet its desired outcome so of course there are so many uh, responsibilities that a project manager uh, uh, will have or that a pr project manager has actually so I will um, maybe give, leave it to you so that you can uh, maybe do a bit of some more research and see what else are uh, what other responsibilities does a project manager uh, have okay so it's very very uh, important well I was just introducing to you uh, this topic um, of course the course rather uh, project management and uh, we just uh, define what the project is we define what project management is and uh, the stages that are found in a project so it's very very important that all the stages are followed through it's important that the project manager should carry out his work and do his work effectively why because every project has a desired outcome thank you so much i encourage you to study your notes go through the notes uh, on the site uh, tired.lenmesh.com and ensure that you are studying as we bring to you these uh, videos uh, on youtube which are a summary of course of all the notes that you are receiving thank you so much i'll see you tomorrow for the next class as we take uh, project management the next uh, level you do have a good day. God bless you.